Last year, we spoke to you at All Energy 2012. Can you tell us what Hammerfest has been doing in the years since then? Well, we have been focusing on uh, two uh, issues. First of all, we have uh, costly experiences with uh, the HS1000, which has been deployed at, uh, at the EMEC test site and having the experience from actually producing power and uh, running that machine for some time. And uh, in parallel to that, we have also been looking at uh, commercial projects and uh, we are currently uh, considering two such projects here in Scotland and uh, come quite far on, uh, on those neg negotiations with our customers. Could you tell us a little bit more about the commercial projects, like who your partners are and what sort of stage in their development they're at? Well, we are, of course, in, uh, in an early stage in that way that uh, we are in the engineering phase and uh, we have uh, a project which we are looking at uh, together with the Scottish Power Renewables and uh, another project where we are looking at uh, a joint development with uh, Majin in uh, Dependent Firth. And have there been any uh, particularly significant technical developments in the tidal technology or the other aspects of the tidal project system since we last spoke to you? I would say that uh, what we're doing now is based on uh, the same I say, base concept as we have been in the HS1000 at EMEC. Mm -hmm. But of course, uh, we have had a lot of learnings, uh, both from uh, the uh, design and uh, construction process and now from the uh, operating uh, operation of that machine. So they are a constant uh, development. But basically, the concept is uh, pretty much the same as, uh, as the one you see here. And um, what do you think the company needs in the next sort of five years to really take the technology to market and, uh, and install commercial scale, scale projects? I think the key thing for, uh, for us is to, uh, to ensure that uh, the reliability of the machine is uh, as good as it uh, should be, uh, which means that they can operate with uh, high uh, availability. And uh, secondly, that uh, it is uh, performing well when it comes to uh, power production. So you have a high yield. And then uh, another key issue will of course be to, uh, uh, to reduce costs uh, the coming years. So uh, that is really the key issues in this one. Thank you very much. Good to see you again. Likewise. Right. Thank you.